Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. If you can do me a favor, can you like and subscribe? Hit that bell icon, that way you don't miss out on a single video because we're doing a bunch of crazy stuff here. So let's do it. So today's topic today that I really wanted to discuss is I, I actually get a lot of people that you know know me from my past uh, like 550 pound life almost. Not too sure because they had to weigh me on a laundry scale. Cause I was like 530, I think at that time. And I know I gained a lot of weight, uh, after that, but, uh, a lot of people ask me like, how'd you do it? How'd you keep it off? And I was actually talking to, uh, this old man at work today and he was asking me all sorts of questions and it inspired me to actually make this video because he was very shocked that I went from such a, you know, a, a, a very high weight when I was in my twenties to what I'm at now and I was discussing with him. I'm like, yeah, like I worked a gas station job at the time and there was like no way in hell I could do this job at 25 instead of like 45 now. And he got to be asking me a lot of questions like, oh, how'd you do it? You know, like how'd you stick to it? And, and, my, and my answer to him today was just simply, I just started eating real food. And like any time that I strayed away from processed foods, I lost weight, I got to a healthy weight. Like right now I'm about 285 and I'm sure you could probably tell, like, you know, I got the loose skin. And for those of you that don't know, my first surgery is February 15th and I am completely ecstatic about it. It's gonna be a life-changing surgery. And in July, I get my tummy tuck and some lipo, my total mommy makeover. It's gonna be fantastic. You know, he was talking about food when he was growing up, how it was just real food and like things like Pop-Tarts and all this crap and like Jimmy John's and all this crap it wasn't really around at the time. An epiphany to him, like, well, you know, he eats the same way he did probably. I mean, this guy's gotta be at least 65 but he eats like the exact same way. My point of the, all of this is though, is once I changed my diet from all the processed stuff and like all the junk and the fast foods and the artificial sweeteners and the just completely went to the point where I just focused on real food, I have success. I was plant-based for like probably six, seven years and I ate real food when I had the best success. And even eating the junk vegan food made me gain weight up to like 320 again. And I was down to 220 just eating real food. My whole point in all of this is, is, the, is the simple fact that just eat real food, try it for a month, try it for two weeks. See how much better you feel after the fact, because I'm telling you right now, I think it takes at least like three weeks for your gut microbes to like stop craving the junk food and start craving like the good food that you're putting into it. You're going to have withdrawal symptoms, just like any other drug that you're getting off of, because the crap that you're eating is literally crap. I mean, like it's, it's, it, it does nobody any good. And for the last like three, four months, I've been trying to do this uh, thing that I read about where they, you know, before you eat something, you say, is this helping me? or is this hurting me? And a lot of times before, you know, I if the scale's going up, I'm eating stuff that's hurting me. If the scale's going down, I'm eating stuff that's helping me. It's really that simple, but a lot of people just don't really get it in their brain that the more junk you eat, the more junk your body's gonna become. And it's really that simple. It's just that people just, we're hooked, we're addicts. We are literal food, addicts and we're drug addicts because the food are, is like pretty much drugs nowadays. I mean, we gotta stay away from this refined bullshit anymore. It's just, it's, that's pretty much what it is. Like it's chemically, those food companies know exactly what they are putting into that food to get you hooked and you will just store body fat. You'll be insulin resistant. Like anything you eat is just gonna just, you're just gonna pile on that and you know it's it's just bad trust me i know this i've yo-yo dieted so many times and i've gained and lost and gained and lost be done with it just just eat real food please like and subscribe there's gonna be way more of the shit coming out take care